Hello friends, I'm very excited today. Package, parcel, delivery. Samson turned six, my eldest turned six in a couple weeks and I bought things in preparation for his birthday, his birthday present and I'm just gonna do a package open up. I only half remember what I bought. So it's like, surprise for me. I got it from Gnomes and Acorns never shopped there before. I was looking at some of the Waldorf stuff from Bella Luna Toys. Beautiful, fell in love with it all. They don't ship to Canada anymore, but it turned out to be a blessing because I could find a local Canadian business. Not local, they're in Toronto. It's halfway across the country, but a Canadian business. So let's see what I bought. Honeycomb. Okay, my nails. Sorry. My dishwasher broke. We've been doing dishes by hand, so... Anyway. This is a kit for making your own candles. I figured we could actually roll some of our own birthday candles that are going to go on his cake. That would be kind of fun. We haven't done those before. How awesome is this packaging? Little reusable bag. And it says, wooden toys handmade from Canadian, Swedish, and German workshops. Ooh. So this is something I hadn't seen until I started Pinteresting Waldorf things. It's a little birthday ring. So my husband is German and we have this little advent ring, which is like this wooden German thing with candles and a little fan. And so this reminded me of it and it's one of his favorite Christmas decorations. So what you do with this is you can put candles in here. You can also put little, um, I've seen they have like these little poster holders where you could put a little card. So it could be used for Christmas, it could be used for Easter, for Valentine's Day or whatever. But specifically for birthdays, And this little clown can go in there. Doo, 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 doo. I think I'm just super into the wooden handmade things at the moment. I have two boys, so I got two different little clowns. And then is this narcissistic? This made me think of like a beautiful breastfeeding mother myself. So I got this <laughs> to go in there too. But on their site, they had roosters, they had stars, they had rainbows, just these really cute little charms that go in the rainbow. And it's um, a decoration you can bring out over and over for all kinds of different things. But we're going to try it this year, first time for a birthday. Ooh, I also got these little beautiful books. This author is my favorite. I hate reading to my children. Oops, talked about that in one of my previous videos, but her books are so beautiful. So this will be part of Samson's birthday present, a couple new books. He likes books and I'd really like to, you know, give books as a gift in hopes that it's something he stays excited for. I don't want to inundate him with electronic toys and toys with batteries. Um, Cause then I think all of these beautiful, simple toys get old really quick, right? <laughs> Speaking of which, here is the main item. Y'all ready for this? It's a wooden shield and a sword. I think it's so cute. I was looking at ones on Etsy. There's tons of options, but um, it just wasn't feasible to ship any of them. And I did buy one for both of my boys. I can't just have him with a sword and shield. He would probably like put his brother in hospital. So now it's even, fair game. But yeah, this beautiful little wooden shield. I don't want to open it yet. We'll open it on his birthday and make a video. But there's a little arm thing. And um, in my best version of reality, they can just go play outside with the shields and the fairies and the tree branches. Hope I'm not being too hopeful on that one. Ooh, and then the last thing I bought here. Oh my gosh, look what they sent me. They sent me this little postcard. Just in time for Easter, that's beautiful. We have a little postcard stand in our Waldorf nature table and we're definitely gonna put this up. Hmm, 
Thank you. Anyway, sorry about that ADD hop around. The last thing I bought um, was these crayons I had never seen before. They're, as far as I know, kind of unique to the Waldorf program. Maybe other people use them too, but block crayons. So beeswax, non-toxic, block crayons. And I'm going to have to learn how to use them as well because it's a totally different style of drawing and doing art. And so I'm excited as we're getting more and more into drawing and sketching. Um, yeah, figure out the Waldorf way as we go. So that is my beautiful haul. Can you hear that? Samson just bellowed that he did a poo. Coming! Okay, looks like my video is done. So that was exciting for me. Hopefully it was exciting for you too. Tell me what you guys do um, for Waldorfy birthdays, if you do the Waldorf method, or just like what is your favorite adorable thing that you do for your kid's birthday? Much love. Have a good day, guys.